The neat thing about the park is uh, the concretions and some of the, uh, the uh, geological uh, th things that are here mm -hmm. that you just don't see anywhere and we're able to save some of that, Absolutely. save a lot of it, a lot of for it. Uh, yeah. the people of Delaware County and uh, uh, it, it just takes a lot of time and a lot of uh, planning to put those things together. It and, does. Uh, it's a, a great place I think to bring the family and uh, a lot of hiking opportunities and again to see things that you just won't see in other parks. But, uh, and there, well, there will be more development coming. We do, always do everything in phases, and this is our first phase. Uh, we'll have more trails and uh, probably a picnic shelter at some point uh, or, or two. I, I think another one, a neat thing, this used to be a church camp, correct? This used to be, and, uh, yes, a church camp. So the old fireplace is still here in the lodge. And mm -hmm. that, again, just another piece of history that's here that uh, people can look at and uh, Get get a feeling of what the history here is yes. in, the, in the area. Yeah, this so. lodge was built in 1939, and um, had as this is its third iteration as usage right now. It was the dining lodge for the Presbyterian Church camp, and then a private owner uh, had it as his residence, and now we've then turned it into um, what we have here, which is a combination meeting space and um, nature center. We first saw this property in 1994. We looked at it, um, but we were unable to purchase it at that time because we didn't have any as, uh, assured financing. In 2004, we were able to acquire 60 acres, uh, totally funded by the OEPA. In 2010, we got the big chunk of 104 acres. But all told, we have about 188 acres here, um, acquired over a period of nine years. And that big chunk really helped us. The big chunk really helped fill us. Fill out the park and really mm -hmm. make it a wonderful mm -hmm. place to go. That was, uh, allowed us then to have space to build our own driveway and uh, make the trail system because some there were restrictions on some of the area that the EPA funded um, as far as development. So um, that was what really made the difference in us being able to move forward with the development of the park. We have 1.1 mile loop trail at this point that traverses uh, both woods and um, former farm field, which we are converting into a prairie. We do have an unimproved trail that is um, somewhat you climb at your own risk type deal um, that goes up and overlooks the hollow um, that of the shale hollow preserve is named for. And um, it overlooks the, the meandering stream and the cliffs and the waterfall that is in the cliffs. Um, but right now it would be really pretty. The cliffs sort of look like they've got powdered sugar all over them.